On to D3 now as the Anna boys and the Lipstick girls lead the team competitions going into day two. Vikings with 21 points as Holly Aversh doubled up on the gold medals as the future Finley Oiler won both the discus and shot put yesterday, becoming the first female state champ in the school's history. Pleasant morning for the D3 finals. We'll start with the girls' 100 hurdles. And it's Rushi's Leah Francis, the silver in 15.2 seconds. Edgerton's Cassidy Flagel third, Fort Lormie's Olivia Quinter in sixth. Boys at 110 high hurdles, while Warren JFK's Chad Zallow wins at first. Lincoln View's Hunter Blankenmeyer comes in second. Arcadia's Clint Rector finishing in a seventh. Girls 100, USV senior Brittany Holbrook just edged by Taylor Middleton. 12.2 to 12.31. Wayne Trey sophomore Monique Goings in eighth. Girls 4x2. Minster third in time of 145.69. Wayne Trace fifth. Spencerville on the podium in seventh place. Boys 4x2. Dylan Alt anchors the win for the Bluffton Pirates in 130.76 seconds. Corey Rawson in second. Waynesfield Goshen in fifth. Minster in seventh. A special win for those Bluffton Pirates. Uh, when I saw Sam Chris come around the corner and he was ahead of Corey Rawson, which was as our like our, our arrivals in this race. I knew right then that we had it. Um, it's kind of it's amazing. Fourth place last year, we ran a better time than we did this year by far, and I just feel like it's a great experience. Uh, when you hand off to a guy like Robbie Stratton, you pretty well know that he's going to get the lead for you, and uh, hand off to Dylan Alt to finish off. On to the girls, 1600 and Botkins. Glory Flora finishing in second in 502. LCC freshman Emily Shreen in fifth. Sixth in the two mile for Shreen. And boys turn at the mile. Lincoln Dew senior Bailey Toe silvers in 420.43 seconds. Harden Northern's Nick Bay making it to the medal stand with a seventh place finish. Girls 300 hurdles now. And Botkins Trojans Whitney Barnhorse in second, 45.21 seconds. Fort Lormie's Olivia Quinter finishing in fifth. Ladies 800 now. And the Minster Wildcats going 2-3. Cassie Francis running 216.82. Julie Slonkowski 217.69. Sprints now. Girls 200. Brittany Holbrook up again for USV against her future Tiffin teammate. And again, Taylor Middleton wins two silvers for Holbrook in today's finals. Girl, guys 200. Corey Rawson's Mason Warnemart fourth in the state. Time of 22.24. Minster's Eli Wolf fifth. Crestview Zach Jellison in sixth place. Boys 4x4, four four. Grant Glover helps Anna to the silver, while Columbus Grove gets bronze, Minster 4th, Riverdale 7th. Finally, girls 4x4, four four. Francis anchors a new state record for the Minster Wildcats, 3 minutes 55.16 seconds. Anna as a boys finish 4th, Grove and Lincoln View tied for 5th, Bluffton 7th for the ladies. Minster, thanks in part of that new state record, 2nd in the state as a team. When I saw Julia coming down straight, I'm like, this cannot be real that we actually have a 60 like meter lead. Like, I was dancing. So I was just getting pumped. I'm just like, all right, let's do this. Like, so I just went and what do you know? Yeah, what do you know? <laughs> I was watching it and Cassie was like trying to catch her out. I'm like throwing my water on her and I'm just screaming. I was so happy. I was so excited. I just tried to start out strong, but we didn't know anything until Cassie Francis yeah, passed that, the that line. Was promised. Yeah, we, I didn't even think we had it until obviously until I saw Cassie in the clock and I was like, oh my gosh, we just got this. Yeah. <laughs> Photobomb by the entire team. The girls team finishes as runner up.